Konnichiwa Minasama, Watashi wa Ashar Desu. This is Ashar bringing you another episode of my Let's Play of Assassin's Creed. I hope everyone's doing well out there today. Let's go be time travelers, shall we? I know, I know, not really. You know what I mean. Alright. Back into memory block four. Back to Damas, or Damascus if you like. Refill your stock by returning to Messiah, or by pickpocketing funds. Alright. Let's find out what our Bureau Chief has to say about our investigation. Peace be upon you, Altair. How may I serve you? I've done as asked and learned all I need to know about my prey. Then you must share your knowledge with me. Abu Naqud is corrupt to the core and despised by his own citizens as a result. It appears he's been stealing money meant for the people of Damas and spending it on himself. Even as we speak, he flaunts his greed, preparing for a lavish party. His guards and servants should have their hands full dealing with the guests. They won't even know I'm there. Most impressive, my friend. The others said you'd make a mess of things, but not I. No, I was sure you'd come through, and come through you have. The Bureau is yours to do with as you please until you're ready to begin. All right. He's a little bit of a suck up, but whatever. All right. Oops. Not running from, running to. Jeez. All I ask is for a few coins. What is he doing? Ever see someone do that before? I am. What's? Oh, hi, guard. Do do do. Don't mind us. We're going to kill you. Sorry about that. Not really, but you you get it, right? Yeah. All right, there's the palace. Oops, no, just, seriously, just go. <laughs> Oops. Uh, we need... Well, this is handy, isn't it? Hi, guys. I'm sure you don't run me. No, don't push me. Don't push me. No. Stop pushing me. Oh, wow, that, that, that crazy guy's a jerk. These guys are stuck. Hmm. Oh, there they go. Much better. Please don't push me! Okay. There we go. All right. This will get us in for sure. Just like an invitation, only better. Because we're just priests and monks. Don't mind the walking weapons cabinet in the center. Only see the outer monks. Bye. See, monks can push people. What's that all about? I can't push people. I get yelled at. It's probably the weapons, though. Okay. Uh, this should be far enough. Yeah? Are you, you guys aren't going already. No, I didn't think so. Here we go.
Oh, there he is. Oh, the coot. Welcome, welcome. Thank you all for joining me this evening. Please eat, drink, enjoy all the pleasures I have to offer. Take your time, I will wait. I trust everything is to your satisfaction. Oh, fountain of wine. Good, good. It pleases me to see you all so happy. For these are dark days, my friends, and we must enjoy this bounty while we still can. War threatens to consume us all. Salah Hadin bravely fights for what he believes in, and you are always there to support him without question. It is your generosity that allows his campaign to continue. So, I propose a toast then, to you, my dear friends, who have brought us to where we are today. May you be given everything you deserve for it. <laughs> Such kindness! I didn't think it in you! You, who have been so quick to judge me, and so cruel. Oh, do not feign ignorance! You take me for a fool! That I have not heard the words you whispered behind my back. Well, I have, and I fear I can never forget. But this is not why I called you here tonight, no. I wish to speak more of this war and your part in it. You give up your coin quick as can be, knowing all too well it buys the deaths of thousands. You don't even know why we fight. The sanctity of the Holy Land, you'll say, or the evil inclination of our enemies. But these are lies you tell yourselves. <laughs> yes. No. All this suffering is born of fear and hate. It bothers you that they are different, just as it bothers you that I am different. <sighs> Compassion, mercy, tolerance, these words mean nothing to any of you, mean nothing to those infidel invaders who ravage our land in search of gold and glory. And so I say, enough! I've pledged myself to another cause. One that will bring about a new world in which all people might live side by side in peace. <sighs> a pity none of you will live to see. <laughs> Free poison one. tries to escape. How? How did he do that? Stay away from me! Get out of my way! Don't stop him! Get him away from me! Alright, buddy. Be at peace now. Their words can no longer do harm. Why have you done this? You stole money from those you claim to lead. Sent it away for some unknown purpose. I want to know where it's gone and why. Look at me. My very nature is an affront to the people I rule. And these noble rogues did little more than to muffle their shouts of hate. So this is about vengeance then? No, not vengeance. My conscience, how could I finance a war in service to the same God that calls me an abomination? If you do not serve Salah Din's cause, then whose? In time, you'll come to know them. I think perhaps you already do. Then why hide? And why these dark deeds? Is it so different from your own work? You take the lives of men and women, strong in the conviction that their death will improve the loss of those left behind. A minor evil for a greater good? We are the same. No, hmm. we are nothing alike. Ah, but I see it in your eyes. 
you down. You cannot stop us. We will have our new world. Oh boy, let's get out of here. I don't want to stick around for all that. That's a lot of guys to attack and kill. Oh. Okay, let's go over the wall. Yes! Good roll. And up, 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 up. Here we go. The roofs. Okay, now we have to find a hiding place. Like this. And blue. That crazy racket going on in that little archer dude is like, Meh, I'm just gonna walk my beat. Ooh. Don't want to go through there? No, stay the roost. Stay the roof cell tire. No, no, no. Nope. Just I'm not here, buddy. <laughs> oh boy. Do do do. Don't throw rocks. Don't throw rocks, guys. Come back here. Don't, no, don't throw rocks. Please stop throwing rocks. Yes, jump after me. That's good. And roll. Bye. Only one guy brave enough to follow after me, huh? I just got lost. Because I couldn't kill that archer guy fast enough. Man, don't get, don't they get tired of ringing that gosh darn bell? All right, here we go, and we're gonna drop in and talk to the bureau chief. Word has reached me of your success, Altair. Abu Nakud's reign of terror is at an end. I'm glad to hear it. He killed them, the men and women at his party. It was poison, a coward's tool. Blamed them for the war. Said he wished to end it. Strange. But then again, the merchant king was known to be a bit... different. Perhaps this was simply a symptom of his madness. Perhaps. You sound unconvinced. Speak with Al-Mualam then. He may offer a better explanation. Yes. We'll see what he has to say. Yeah. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. All right. Should we, uh, we should call it here. Yeah. We have discussed a successful assassination. Uh, not what we could, could have done about the uh, poison wine, though, which sucks. Like, hey, free alcohol! By the way, it was poisoned, you're dead. Ouch. So, he's gone, and uh, pretty decent assassination. I didn't have to chase him very long, and uh, didn't have too much trouble getting back to the Bureau. So, until next time, I'm Ashar.